I had a vision uh, when I put my forms in about uh, and standing for deputy president that I would try and reach out to all members wherever they were, uh, no matter what speciality they worked in, I wanted to be able to um, gain access and uh, talk to members face to face to understand what it is that they want myself and you uh, to do in our roles. Um, this role is completely different to all the other roles that I've played because the other roles have been mainly regional seats or um, uh, governance roles and this I see as encapsulating the whole membership so it doesn't matter where you work in the acute, the independent or private sector, whether you are um, a learning rep or working in the prison services or in social care or hospice care. Um, I want to be able to reach out to all the members and I know that we've got some meetings coming up working with the RCN staff to try and achieve that. We do some amazing things in the organisation, uh, but I, I think we could share a bit more and communicate a bit better on what brilliant stuff we're doing within the organisation. Um, and I want to look at ways in which we can share every aspect of what we're doing because we do do some amazing stuff um, to support and protect members. And it's about, I see my role as signposting members um, if members come to us and say, well, we need this, um, you know, what, what's the RCN's position on this? We can then contact those key people that are doing some amazing pieces of work and then share that back out with the membership. I think we're good at doing all the stuff, but we're probably a bit weak in sharing that with the membership and the membership not understanding. And in these current times, it's about sometimes all it takes is somebody to listen um, you know, it's difficult to fix everything. I'd like to fix everything because that's that's in my makeup to try and have a problem, try and fix it. But in a pandemic where we're all dealing with it all at the same time, with all the added pressures, sometimes it just takes somebody to listen and somebody to signpost them to where they can get the information and the appropriate support 